What's up you guys? It's Ashlinsky. I'm kind of whispering because it is 11 o'clock at night. I didn't feel up to making videos today and I was doing things. So I'm doing one really late and my husband's trying to go to sleep so I'm going to be quiet. And I have my new little setup in my, uh, I want to say this is our spare room. I call it the office. I am now going to call it the lair. I'm going to do a little tiny miniature setup tour. That's coming soon, don't worry. But um, at Second and Charles, uh, I noticed today they had some $2 blind bags of sorts. They're not true blind bags. They are um, hero clicks. They're the Captain America hero clicks. So these are like, I don't know what hero clicks are. I think it's like a board game or something. It says miniature game piece. So that's what these are. I don't know if you can see that. But it's um it's like a game piece for Hero Clicks, whatever that is. And um so yeah, I picked up a couple of these. Um I got a Digibon. They have a whole bunch of blind bags at Second and Charles, by the way. It was like Christmas for people who love blind bags. Um, there was a Digimon one, so it comes with a little, like, display. It's so cute. And there's, like, nine different Digimon, and you can, like, collect them, and then you can stack them. Um, this Nickelodeon one, it's just, like, a key ring. I thought it was cute. Um, my friend got one and she got Rocco out of it. So I was like, oh, I wonder which one I'll get. Um, I got a Rick and Morty by, uh, I think these are Funko brand. They're the Mystery Minis. And there's a whole bunch of these that you can get. And I got one of those. And then last but not least, this is the one I'm most excited for. Um, this is by Kid Robot. Um, they put out, like, I want to say I saw these like a month or so ago for the fractured butthole um, for the new game coming out so these are like the superhero versions of the kids the box is cool I think I'm gonna end up even keeping the box um, so I'm gonna open these and see what I get and I'm gonna start with I'm gonna start with the Digimon I think because I love Digimon but like I kinda got this on a whim because these um these dome collectibles are new to me um they have one for gravity falls as well which i was gonna get but i've never seen the show yet it's on my list oh, boy. oh and it's covered so i can't see what it is oh boy okay so i opened it this was, this was a really nice neat package too it was easy to open i didn't need scissors or anything Okay, let's see, how do I open this? Okay, there's a little thing here. Ooh, excitement. <gasps> I got one of my favorite Digimon. I got Patamon. Patamon was always one of my favorites. And I want to say it was because I could, like, relate to the little kid. But... I just really liked Patamon, and I loved when he finally evolved into Anjumon. It was just like a beautiful moment. I still have an Anjumon action figure somewhere, actually. That's how much I loved that character. I'm trying to think. What do I want to do next? I think I'm going to do the Nickelodeon one next. If I don't get Reptar, I'm going to be so sad. Okay. There's no little open spot. I don't know how I'm going to open it. And the nice thing about, oh gosh, I already see what I got. It's not a blind thing. Um, let me rip this off. I got Arnold from Hey Arnold, who according to this package, which I noticed when my, my friend got one, um, Arnold has a last name. I don't ever remember in the show, but it's Arnold Shortman. I never remember him having a last name in the show, but apparently he did. A little football head. He's kind of like, he's, I don't know what he's made out of, but it's really like, it's soft and it's hard, but I feel like it could be squishy, but it's really not. I like that. I'm probably going to put him on my key ring. He's cute. Or I'm going to sit him on my TV stand with my new setup. Hint, hint. 
All right, I'm going to leave the two like great ones for last. So we're gonna go to the hero clicks of Captain America, the Winter Soldier. I'm sorry, if I don't get Falcon or Bucky, I'm gonna be really upset because those are my favorite characters from the movie. Oh, please let it be. Oh, I think I see what it is. If you don't know this, I'm a ginormous, um, I'm a, I'm a, I, I love Sebastian Stan, but like, Bucky Barnes is like my favorite character and, and, and the Winter Soldier, my favorite characters in the whole Marvel Universe. I think I said it in a previous video and like, I've got my tattoo of it and I have to finish it, but ooh, I got the, the Bucky, but I got the Winter Soldier. I don't know what a hero clicks does. I know if you like move it, there's a wheel on the bottom or something. And it came with this little card, not just a sniper, a hollow point ammo. I don't know, it's like a card. I don't know if it's like a how to play card or like when you play what he does. It's interesting. Oh, he's so cute. And like I have action figures and stuff and comics even still of Winter Soldier out of all the comics I've ever had. Those are the only ones I like kept. He's so cool. He's so cool. He's definitely going on my desk. He's not, he doesn't get to go on the TV. He goes on the desk. Oh, please let it be Falcon. Please let it be Falcon. Oh. If I get a Falcon though, I honestly might have sent it to my sister because she, she likes Falcon. Oh, I got a lame shield soldier. I can't pronounce that. Shield soldier. Try saying that ten times fast. He has a card as well. So it's like point values and stuff. I don't. I, I should probably look up what Hero Clicks actually is. He's not. He's not terrible looking. He looks pretty cool. He'll look neat next to Bucky with his like arm pose. There's a sticker on him. He's pretty neat. I don't know what he does. <laughs> those are pretty cool. That was that was pretty much worth the. Those were two bucks each for, and I was like, well, for blind bag, two bucks isn't bad. Okay, now I'm going to do the Rick and Morty one, which they have a lot that it could be. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. There's sixteen different ones it could be. I don't know how well you can see that. I'm really hoping I get Doofus Rick. Doofus Rick is probably my favorite version of Rick. Yes, I know, he eats poop. But you know what? He was just a swell version of Rick. I just realized the, the Purge Girl is on here. Oh my gosh. Oh boy. All right, Funko, don't do me wrong. Please don't do me wrong, Funko. The Funko bags, they black them out so you can't see what you're getting. But like, I could probably feel what it is. I wonder if the, the kid robot does that as well. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, well, I'm expecting this one. I got Rick. He's cool. He's just a little miniature version, but what are the chances? 1 in 12. Okay, so he's a 1 in 12 chance. I could have, I could have got almost anybody. I like him though. He's very, he, he looks a little detailed. He's cool. He's gonna go on my TV stand. I actually just finished catching up with, um, well not catching up all the way. We watched, Will and I watched, um, episodes 1 through 5 of season 3. It was really good. I really enjoyed it. Oh, yes. Kid Robot. Woo. They have a set. Now, I got this at Best Buy. Um, they do have a set of Mysterion, Professor Chaos, and the Coon in like little, like they're probably no bigger than Rick. And you can buy that and it's, I think that was like 30 bucks or something. They also have like big a big, like, it's a box like this big by like this wide of, also by Kid Robot, that is, I think a glow-in-the-dark Mysterion, 
the Coon and Professor Chaos, which they look really cool, but those are unfortunately are $50 each. And uh, I, I love, I love the South Park games and like getting this, I feel like it's kind of supporting. Well, the, yeah, good, these bags are, you can't see what it is, okay. I feel like getting these kind of supports the game a little bit to like let people know like, yes, I enjoy what you're doing and putting out, so. Um, I'm actually gonna get rid of this because I'm hope hopefully they'll put out some like merch for the the new game, a poster or something. Oh, I'm so excited! I don't really care who I get, but I would love to get. Um, oh my gosh, who are the new characters? I'd kind of love to get Mysterion, but I would take any of them. It doesn't really matter to me. They all look really cool. They don't have one of um, Jimmy, who they made the Flash, which seemed a little cruel to me, but whatever. I don't care. I, I don't know. I'll take whoever I get. I say that now. I'm going to be disappointed. <gasps> oh, jeez. I got Professor Chaos. Woo! He's so cute. He's like adorably evil. Oh, I remember the first episode that he was in as Professor Chaos. It was so freaking great. Oh, I'm so happy. Uh, although, like I said, I could have got any one and I would have been happy because I really like how all the characters look for the new game, which I did pre-order this game, by the way. I'm going to try my best to play it for the channel. So that was my little my little blind bag opening. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you would want to see more of this, let me know. Um, my, my local second and Charles, a lot of these blind bags were actually pretty cheap. I think the most expensive one was probably the South Park one from Best Buy. But other than that, the most expensive one was the Rick and Morty one, just because it's Funko. So let me know, do all the things, like, comment, subscribe, comment, make videos almost every day. Sometimes I just don't feel good enough to make them and Sometimes I just try and then I give up halfway through like I did today. <laughs> but anyways, I will see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.